Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I wanted to share with you things that I use for VIP Kid for props. Um, if you're in this for the long term, I think it's great to invest because you'll probably be teaching multiple lessons over. Um, so this is what I am doing for my VIP Kid and um, I'll even tell you prices. So these dolls were about five um, dollars each and I got them from Walmart. Um, one of the lessons does have a doll in it and one has a cat. This is Lily and Rainbow and I use them um, with my students to help interact. Another great thing to have is index cards and you can write numbers. Like you don't need to go buy um, flash cards. Like you can make them yourself. I used these last night and she knew exactly what the numbers were. So um, just make it fun with markers and color it and yeah. Um, speaking of making props, all you need is markers, cardstock, and a laminator and laminating pouches. Um, these are some that I created last night, Fruit, Veggies, This Fish. You can also go online and get free clip art, um, print that off and color it yourself. It also saves on ink, so if you're a little artsy, just use that talent. Um, another thing I use is a baking sheet for my um, to keep my magnets um, in place and to hold them. I also have a folder that I put um, these magnets in. Now I always laminate and I put a magnet on back so that when I'm using my whiteboard, which is up here, it's easy to stick and I still have a free hand. Now for the reward system, I just cut it out, laminated it, and... It works great. Um, we Yesterday was a birthday lesson, and so I made a birthday cake with candles, and every time they did good, they got a candle and the birthday cake. This is also my backdrop. Everything here was from the dollar store, and I made it fun and bright and exciting, and it's just um, hooked up with push pins, and it was easy. But it also creates a great environment for learning, and so... Um, so there's my tip, go to the dollar store and just make your own, have fun with it. Make it who you are and I know the kids will enjoy it and you'll feel more confident teaching because you have a great backdrop. I know that sounds silly, but um, the more you are prepared, the easier teaching's gonna be, okay? Um, and I think that goes for anything in life. Um, being prepared relieves a lot of stress. So let's say, so we're probably always going to have food. And so if I just, for each new lesson, if I just make something for that lesson and I have it again, it's already done and I don't have to stress. It's already laminated. It's not going anywhere. It has magnets. Now the magnets I did get at Walmart and I got them in a big pack in the craft section, like 52 for like five or six dollars. And they're just the little magnets. Um, so yeah, also... For the numbers and letters, um, this pack was also at Walmart, and it had numbers and letters in it, and like subtraction, um, addition, and those signs. And so that's why I wanted it, because you can get the letter magnets in the cooking section, but I wanted numbers as well. So this is what I'm doing for VIP Kid. I hope that you get some great tips and advice here to help with your teaching. Let me know what you do. I'm a very interactive person, and that's what VIP Kid wants. They want someone who's going to interact, use a lot of TPR. That's like a lot of hand motions um, signaling to the student. And it also keeps them engaged, because if you have a student who's having a really hard time paying attention, these props will help because it just, it breaks the flow of the slides. So yeah, um, thank you so much for watching and um, good luck on VIP Kit. I'll put my referral link um, in the bottom and yeah, we'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye!